Good morning everybody. Uh, it's a nice, bright, sunny morning. Uh, time is 09.53 on Friday the 21st of August. I don't know, something like that. And this morning I'm going to Berwick, uh, the Berwick Inn, to meet up with a couple of old friends of mine. Uh, one's got a trike and not sure what the other one will be riding probably a Harley Davidson anyway I'm out with my uh, favourite bike of all time the uh, Royal Enfield Himalayan and uh, hopefully we'll have a, a reasonable ride we're going to go from uh, the Berwick Inn to the Marsh Cafe between East Pevensey and Bexhill. Yeah, between Pevensey and Bexhill. So, uh, hopefully, it'll be half a decent ride. So, uh, I'll catch up with you when we get to the Berwick Inn. Well, just met my friends here. Uh, as you can see, what a lovely trike this is. And uh, this is John on the trike, and that's Adrian on his Harley. So uh, we're just about to uh, ride off now up to uh, the Marsh Cafe via wherever. So uh, we'll get going. That is some beast of a machine. Uh, this should be a really interesting ride today. I don't know which one's the louder of the two. It'll turn out to come out of there right across the lines and uh, we're Kushti going down now through Berwick itself onto the uh, Dicker, and then I think we're going up through Ninfield, Standard Hill, Ninfield, uh, and then down through to the Marsh Cafe that way uh, through who? Not sure, Adrian's uh, taking the lead this morning, so uh, interesting to see what route he decides to take. Oh, John wants me to go ahead of him. Okay. Now we're coming into Upper Dicker. Reminds me of um, something I saw on the uh, WhatsApp from the uh, Bantam Club. There's a guy who's uh, doing a tour of England uh, visiting all towns and villages that have rude names. It is quite interesting. He's doing it on a scooter, which is absolutely marvellous. That was uh, on the left hand side back there was St Bede's private school. Very expensive. And this village shop here 
is actually amazing. It's old, really old school. Let's see if I can. It sort of sat back right down the bottom there, and it's like an old cottage. Probably didn't get much of a glimpse of it, which is a shame. But it's a really old cottage that's uh, converted into the village shop, and it's been there for donkey's years. Certainly as long as I can remember. And my memory is quite good, so. Now we're coming. Uh... Down into Lower Dicker. And uh, meet the A22, turn right uh, and go down to uh, <laughs> through uh, Horsebridge and uh, Hellinglai and Windmill Hill and through to Standard Hill up through Ninfield, down through Who, and then hopefully breakfast. This is a bit of a nightmare to get out on this road because it is the main A22 to uh, London. Eastbourne to London. going through Horsebridge and then uh, onward to Windmill Hill and up through Ninfield. But, uh, you've done this trip before so uh, I'll pick it up the other side of Ninfield. Actually, we've come a slightly different way to uh, to what I thought. I thought we were going through Ninfield and down through Who, but uh, we've actually we've actually come down on the uh, the Marsh Road past uh, Hurstman Zoo Castle, or what was the old observatory, and. Uh, now heading down to the Pevensey roundabout and then uh, along the Pevensey Strait to the uh, to the Marsh Cafe. now called the Custom Cafe. And here we are, arrived at the Custom Cafe. Well, we've just
just uh, finished the breakfast and uh, very nice it was too actually it wasn't that good to be fair uh, it was all right but it wasn't brilliant uh, apparently according to my friends that were there it's uh, not as good as it used to be oh it's getting a little bit windy um, so anyway we've now uh, sort of split up and uh, we're on our way back uh, to uh, well I'm on my way back to, to home and they've uh, they're making their way uh, back to Seaford which is where they come from uh, before we met a Berwick this morning but, uh, yeah the weather stayed fine so it's uh, pretty good we're back on the marsh road and uh, they'll probably go down through Pevensey and I will go up the A22 to the Bowship Roundabout and back that way. Maybe go fill it up with fuel. This is very busy today. Not sure why. 